Hey, Jeannie, what are you doing? Oh, hi, Professor Berger. I just drew this picture of you. Oh, can I see it? Yes. Oh, let me take a look. Wow, that's wonderful. It seems like I have a blank stare on my face. I mean, I'm missing my eyes and my nose and my mouth and my ears and um, my eyebrows. Well, and... Professor Berger, could you help me with that? Sure. You see, I didn't know how many of those things to draw on your face. What a great question and what a great, great reason to talk and write the number of things that we have on our face. Oh, show me. Okay, so let's take a look. So why don't we start, now here is a five frame, mm -hmm. and so that's going to help us count, and we can actually use counters to help us count. So let's start with this. The nose. Exactly. <laughs> so if I now bring in a nose, there's the nose, mm -hmm. and now we can actually use a counter to count. And so how many? One. Exactly. And now let me show you how to actually write the number one. And it's fun actually thinking about writing numbers. So let's now write the, the number one. And, and the, the real issue here, and this is what's really, really important, is where you place the pencil to start writing. Mm. And with the number one, there's a little blue dot and the up, up, up on top there, and that's where you start. So you start on top and you just go straight down, just like that, once down. Here, let me show you that again. Start on top, once down. Here, you try it. Start on top, once down. You once say, down. Again. Once down. There you go. That's the number one. Isn't that cool. great? Okay, let's try, whoops, let's try the other things that we see around us. Okay, and in fact, speaking of seeing, how about this? What's that? That is an eye. Exactly. So there are our eyes. And now, let's use the counters to see how many eyes we have. So there's one counter for one mm -hmm. eye. And there's another counter for another eye. And so therefore, how many eyes? Two. Exactly, two eyes. Now, how do you write the number two? Mm. Well, this is really neat. I like this one. This is kind of fun, actually. Now, of course, it always is important to know where to start. So we're going to start at the little at the little blue dot, uh -huh. and now the motion is whoosh and over. Let me show you that again. Mm -hmm. You ready? Mm -hmm. Whoosh and over. You say it. Okay. Whoosh and over. And that's the number two. <laughs> oh, neat. Is that neat? Yeah. Let's, let's try one more together just for fun. Okay. What do you say? Yes. All right. So let me now, the eyes already had it, so we're going to take the eyes away. And now, let's listen to this question. How about the ears? <gasps> yeah. The ears. Now, how many are there? Well, in fact, this is a great riddle for all of us to think about. So I'll give you a chance to actually think about and see if you can figure out how many ears there are. <gasps> what number of ears do we have? <laughs> all right, well, let's see how we did. So we put one counter for the first ear and another counter for the other ear. And so all together, what number of ears do we have? Two. Exactly. And there's the, the number two. And that's the answer. Yes. And look, while you were counting ears, I finished my drawing. Oh, can I see? Yes. Oh, let's take a look. Oh, I love it! It looks just like me! It's fantastic! <laughs> Thank you so much, Jeannie. But, but I have one question. What's that? Why are there two mouths? That is because you are not supposed to talk with your mouth full. That's right. Yeah, so I gave you two mouths. One to eat with and one to talk with. That is brilliant, Jeannie. But if you're going to give me two mouths, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to eat with both of them. <laughs> Have lots of fun thinking about math. We'll see you soon. Bye. You're so silly. No, you're silly. No, you're silly.